my god. Alright, let's get him over here. So we don't freaking die in this. Woo! Okay. What is good, everybody? My name is Johnny, and welcome to the Nightmares at the Krusty Crab. Now, we played this game last year, but it was with zombies, and there was, like, different endings, and I figured, you know what, we're gonna come back to it, since they did some different stuff with it. Oh my god. Okay. 9.27. Today is Tuesday at the Krusty Crab. Mr. Krabs had Squidward and I work at the night shift. I'm getting very tired. Good to know. What happened? 1 a.m. Okay. No matter what six fantasy Dirt number two. Mind, I will not go back to that Mr. Mr. I guess I fell asleep. The lights are out. I'm going to turn on lights and the TV to see what happened outside the kitchen. Let's see what's happening outside the kitchen. How do I turn this on? I think it's already on. Oh my god. Oh, there's something next to that door. Is that the high second slasher? <laughs> I forgot about that. <laughs> Who's banging on the door? Gun loads. <laughs> let's go where he's dead. Okay. Let's go, baby. Let's do this. Okay, SpongeBob, let's get it then. Oh, give me that stuff. All right, we're going to get the money going. Squidward's dead. I hear something. Squidward warned me of the hatchling and slashes. There has to be a way out of here. Okay. Let's go ahead and get out of here. They're outside. So I said we come out here. Get that money up. What do you guys think? Get that money up. All right. And then... Oh, they're just going to spawn indefinitely. Okay. Get this money up. So you get money for killing, but you don't get money like zombies where you just hit them once. That's all right. So it takes how many shots? Four shots to kill him? Four shots. So I should be able to kill this guy before I got to reload. So I said we get some money up. Get them freaking new guns. This guy's almost dead. Okay. Go ahead and round him up over here. <clears throat> Come on. Die. Go ahead and get that money up. $88. $96. And I keep reloading like halfway through my clip. Can't spawn behind me, right? Nope. Okay. I'm over here. All right, so there should be a different gun. Let's see how much, there's a gun in here, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, how much is this? Did it freeze? Okay, 100 bucks. Better go. All right, now, oh my God, we can go, go, go outside, go outside, go outside. Ah! Oh my God. All right, let's get him over here. So we don't freaking die in this. Eighty-two health. He hit me. Get that money up. They just keep spawning indefinitely. We need a grenades or something. So we actually do gain health back over time, which is nice. My god, dude, there's just so many freaking hashling slashers. Plankton needs the formula. Come back in here and see if we can get something. <gasps> there we go! We got it! Okay, let's, let's get this ammo. Go, 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 go! All right, we got we got the freaking spatula. <gasps> oh, the spatula's right there. I think we got the freaking the, the formula. Okay, I guess we'll go for the the plankton one first and see what happens. <gasps> Dude, we're inside the chum bucket. It's it's 4 a.m. I don't got a gun. How do I get? What do I gotta do? 
Plankton's voice through the intercom. Well, 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 if it isn't Spongebob, you fell right into my trap. That's right, this whole thing was just an experiment to get the formula. I didn't even have to walk into the Krusty Krab myself. Now that I have the formula, I must dominate the world. Time to destroy Bikini Bottom with my giant robot and get world domination. Okay? Plan is going to destroy the Bikini Bottom. I need to fight him before he does. He looks at like there are flamethrowers on his arms. I have to keep moving and avoid the fire. Destroy Plenty before the Bikini Bottom. Woo! Okay! I have unlimited ammo, apparently. Okay, so my question is how do we. I. Okay. A few moments later. About a freaking big baby. Let's go. Plankton is down. Epilogue events. Plankton died. Oh, I, got the, I got the best ending. Plankton died in an explosion after fighting SpongeBob. He never used the formula or conquered land outside of the Bikini Bottom. The explosion. Something. Sandy successfully, successfully survived the outbreak after building a jetpack. She also built and distributed weapons to surviving citizens, which led to many more people surviving. Mr. Krabs uses his arsenal and escaped Miss Bikini Bottom with his daughter Pearl. Nobody knows where he went and what happened to him. He was never seen again. Squidward died of a, tra a tragic death in the hash slinging slasher. A statue was made in memorial displayed in the Bikini Bottom years later. His art was also recognized and became a celebrity. Patrick survived the outbreak. He used his house, a rock, as an underground shelter. He lives a normal life in the Bikini Bottom today. Bikini Bottom was in ruins after the fight. 75% of the population died or left. It is still being restored today. More citizens are moving in and in his history books written about the events. Spongebob lived on 30 more years and died a peaceful death. The entire ocean now saw Spongebob as a hero who saved the sea. Statues are made around the world complimenting his bravery. Rest in peace, Steven Hillenburg. Okay! I like it! Listen, I don't think we can do anything better than that. We beat Plankton. We saved Bikini Bottom, Squidward's a celebrity, and Spongebob lived on for another 30 years and then died peacefully in a sleep or something like that. What more could you ask for? Alright everybody, this was the Nightmares at the Krusty Krab. This is the remake with the Hatchling and Slash. If you enjoyed it, make sure to do the YouTube thing. Like, comment, subscribe, and share with your friends. As always guys, my name is Johnny, and I'll see you guys in the next video.